one thing we can maybe teach them to do is to knock this back and forth to each other. Let's see. Gertie, can you back up? Back. There you go. All right, what else can you do? Gertie. Good. So that was great because we got one donkey hitting it, then the other donkey. Gertie, what else can you do? Touch. Good. So we got two donkeys doing it. That's great. Let's see if we can get another one. You got a little something right there, friend. Get that for you? Get it. No? What else can you do? We'll take it somewhere else. Maud, what else can you do? <laughs> Touch. One more time. Oh, it's like I got an itch. Gertie's like, I can stomp and do it. Good. Good donkeys. Cool. So hopefully we can take this concept with this ball and get them to do more. Let's just have one more. Okay, what else can you do, donkeys? Yeah, no. Good. All right. Let's go try something else, you two. This way. Let's go. Trying to come up with cooperative games is a great way to deal with any animals who, like Gertie and Maud, are not the best about. What else can you do? Oh, it's kind of warm. Let's not do that. Let's go this way. And we'll play with the gate. So for this one, let's see if we can get them pushed back and forth. One donkey pushing one way and the other donkey pushing the other way. Good job. We'll just see what we can do. Touch. Good. Maud, touch. Good. So Maud touched one side. Gertie touched the other side. Let's see if we can do it again. What else can you do? Gertie pushes. Maud pushes. I do. That's exactly what we're after. These sort of cooperative games be super great for just building, like they're both having fun and enjoying something. Oh, back it up. Gertz, can you come over here? What else can you do? Your mod's pulling, Curtis. That's great. That was pretty cool. Do that again. <laughs> Both of them pushing together. That's also great. Do that again. We'll get them both. Just uh, opening and closing gates for everybody at the ranch. Yeah. That was really good. All right, let's, another game that we can play with them is leave it. So that was just some, leave it. It's just gonna be hard with each other there. Gertie's like, I don't know, I wanna touch it. Good, take it. We'll see if we can get a better one. No donkey pulling. Leave it. Take it. So they're just collectively working to ignore it. Well, so bite, leave it. A lot of times if you start playing these cooperative games, it's important to remember that you should start teaching the animals individually. What else can you do? And then try and combine it once they already have a sense of the game. So they've both played with these. And that was good. Maud, what do you got? That was great. Take it. All right, let's go. Can you back up for me? You're just gonna block the way. Mod's like, I don't know where we're going. Come on. Let's this up. I wanna see that. Another great cooperative game is just going together places. Mod, where are you off to? Mod's gonna clean up that hay. All right, I guess it's me and you then, Gertie. In a circle. Oh, that's fine. Good job. You can go snack. Okay, go snack. Give them a snack break. All right. So that was some co cooperative gameplay with them. You can do leave it. You can do 
off-lead stuff, but work individually with each animal. Now I just want to try something pretty different, which is playing them some brain from other donkeys and seeing if they have any sort of reaction. So we'll give them a little break to just explore and not have to think for a second, and then we'll do some of that. And they'll re-engage with me when they're ready. That river romp was pretty great today. <laughs> Mod's like, I want to hang out with you. Maybe we'll get Gertie to show off a little bit of her retrieve after she's cleaned up that hay, too. But I'm not sure what the donkeys will do when they hear brain sounds. Hopefully they'll get pretty excited. Let's see if they think to come over and check it out. Mod's doing a good job cleaning up all the hay. No response. No response. And <laughs> it's just so indifferent. I really expected them to think, have a bigger response to that. Oh, this is an ad. I'm sorry. We'll turn down the volume. Oh, Mod might be interested. Come on. Show Vince how much you love us. We like this one? Come on. That got them coming. Good job. <laughs> this happy donkey call. Hey, fella. Oh, look at you. Oh, it's been a long time. Oh, look at you. All right, we'll pause that one. There's a lot more talking than I was expecting. Let's see one more. Let's see what the donkeys do for the next one. Oh my, uh, my search disappeared on me. Hi, leave it. Relax. There we go. Have you done ballet? Everything is uh, freaking out on my phone here. Sorry, y'all. One more donkey bray. Leave it. No, nope, we might be out of donkey brace. All right. <laughs> Bad click for both of you. Let's do a little bit of, we'll, we'll do a couple more um, fun things they can do together. Another really great one is, yeah! Just getting some enthusiastic recalls. Good job, Gertie. There you go. Come on! Where's your yeehaw? Did you leave it at home today? You left it in your pen? Okay. Relax. So practicing running to person is a great way to get them comfortable moving about with each other in exciting ways, but also hopefully we're practicing a little bit of just relaxed behavior in between where we stop. You gotta wait for Mod. And also, hopefully, Gertie stops laying ears at Mod. Good job. Good job. Because she's gotta wait until Mod gets here for her reinforcement. Take it. Leave it. Leave it. Oh, that was a great leave it. Thank you. You too. You did a good job. All right, Gertie, Mod, you missed it, it's right over there. Yeehaw! <laughs> Mod's like, it's too hot for yeehaws. Come on, Mod! Touch. Let's do a little, we'll do a little bit more ball. Good job. Ball. Mod, can you get to it? Mod's like, I don't want to go over there. Girl, it'll bite me. Mod. Good job. Ball.
It's so much easier, Mod, when you're on the other side over there. Mod, Paul. There you go. Let's get you around this side. You back up. Mod, touch. <laughs> She's like, I just don't want to go face to face with my sister. Thanks. You're doing a good job. Can you back up for it, though? Take it. And go back. <laughs> Are you stuck? All right, here. Curdy. Touch. There we are. Good job. Gertie got herself trapped inside that ball. I don't know if you all noticed that. What else can you do? Oh. <laughs> Mod bit the uh, post and Gertie pushed the ball. All right, let's go. Yeah. There we go. Good job, you two. That was great. Here. <laughs> there you go. Let's see if we can get Gertie running around the inside with Mod going around the outside. Let's go. Gertz, come on. You gotta wait for your sister. Whoa. Ready? Yeah. Good job. Good job. <laughs> All right. What else do you two like to do together? You both gonna bite that post? Yeah. Oh, that's a good thing to do. Yeah. What else can you do? Now that we've played some collective games, Gertie's a little still grumpy about her sister being involved in her training session. Oh, that's a good one. That's her um, behavior from last time that we built into some spinning. Do that again. So Mod's doing her touch again. Gertie's doing her spin again. Do that again. Her spin start. Oh, she's trying a different one. Hide. Hide. Gertie, hide. Mod, touch. All right, we'll take it. What else can you do? We're both thinking. <laughs> Gertie's like, I can do this start of a spin. And Mod's like, I can touch. What else can you do? I wish I could remember what we called that last time, but I'm forgetting now. Do that again. Very good donkeys. Good job playing games nicely together. All right, we got a few more treats, so let's finish off. Just doing a, the same game in a new spot, and we'll call it a day. What do you think? Sound good to you? Gotta wait for your sister to come over to play. You gotta wait for your sister to play. Photo shoot. See you in France. Take it. Take it. We'll do a couple collective photos. Take it. In there. Leave it. <laughs> there you go. Gertie, touch. You got it? <laughs> Mom's like, save me from my sister, please. Yeah, that's a good spot. Mod. Mod's like, I'll go touch this. Good job. She's coming up with fun things she can do while her sister's being rude. I'm going to see if I can get Gertie doing that one more time. Try
trying to manage, manage two donkeys and a phone is not doing me well. Do that again. What was it? Yeah, it was something with your lips. You remember? What else can you do? Oh, that's an interesting thing to do. <laughs> Gertie's just like, I don't know what else I can do. I'm tired. I've done such a good job ignoring my sister. All right, we got one last treat and then we'll call it a day. Um, let's do a yeehaw. Yeehaw! <laughs> Well, you gotta wait for your sister now. That was the problem with chasing her off right away. That was cute, though, how you put your head underneath my arm. Aw, let's go give Maude a treat. Good job. Take it. Take it. All right, everybody. Well, that was a quick, fun session with the donkeys today. Um, we'll be back next week with another episode and do some more work with them. We learned today that they're not that excited about hearing other animals bray. Um, and then also got to do some collective games, which was pretty fun. Next time we'll have McCall around too, so that'll help me with uh, focusing on training a little bit more. Um, a big thank you to James for running the cameras, Suzanne for making everything go, all of you for tuning in, the ranch hands for keeping everybody happy and healthy and moving good. And yeah, we'll see you next time. Thanks everybody, bye.